Hey everyone, today we're going to show you our room that we stayed in at Excellence Playa Mujeres in Cancun, Mexico. One thing to note is we were on the fourth floor, but in the United States you would consider this the fifth floor because the ground floor is floor zero. So here is the entrance to our room. You get a key card that you just tap to open. We were right across from the elevator, but it doesn't ding or anything, so it's no problem. They put It's Our Honeymoon banner on our door, which was really nice. So here's the room, 2402. This is the rooftop terrace room. Here is uh, the view again from the front door of the room. It has the chain to lock the door and next to that is the room service box where they drop off the room service and pick up your dishes. Across the hall from that is the walk-in closet where they have a safe, a couple drawers, some towels, robes, a scale, and some other items that you can use. Then you go over here to the bathroom. Right here is the toilet. Uh, there's even a little phone in here, which is kind of funny. Um, one thing we didn't like about the room was the door for the bathroom since it is glass. Yeah, most of it is frosted, but there is some that isn't frosted. So there's not too much privacy. Same with the shower, but you can throw a towel over the door if you want some extra privacy. There are some shelves in here along with towels. You have a shower head and then here they also have the rainfall shower head. There's a window that you can see the rest of the room and a little rope so you can hang your wet clothes or bathing suits. Then we've got two sinks. This light, it lights up which is very nice and magnified. The mirrors spin around if you need and many toiletries. We've got some toothpaste, shampoo, conditioner, body soap, toothbrush, and lotion, and then some nice shelving right there. Also have a bottle opener because there are some Coke bottles and other bottles in the mini fridge. Alright, so here's the room. We have a full bar, so you get four full bottles of liquor, some glasses to drink out of, an ice bucket, um, a little coffee maker, some chips, and then here is everything in the mini bar. This is all included, and they will refill it for you every day if you take anything out of it. And we definitely used a lot of it. our luggage, um, came with some slippers, and then the bed each had these little lights above them, so that was really nice if you didn't want to have the main light on in the room. A little desk, some of the art, has a full mirror to the left, an alarm clock, the phone, a pretty big TV. Here is the couch with a coffee table. And then over here is the jacuzzi. The windows to the right open up to the outside, which is very nice. But we'll go out this way. Here is our dip pool. This is all for us, which is really nice. And then there's a little bed up here. Here is the view from our room. We are in building two. There were some people below us and the room isn't super private, but 
private enough. We have another bed, two lounge chairs. And then we've got part of the lazy river down here and with the spa in the middle. Over here, we have another bed and a table and two chairs. The balcony is huge and we spent so much time out here. In the dip pool, they have these little fountains that you can turn on and off, which is really nice. Behind the dip pool, there was a little shower with a removable shower head. There was an iguana that was hanging out on one of those beams, which was funny. He was hanging out there all week. Over here is the ocean in the very back, and that's the main area that has the pool. Overall, we absolutely love the room. Like I said, our only complaint, I guess, would be the bathroom door, but overall, no other issues. The resort itself was beautiful. We have a lot more videos going over excellence and the food and the restaurants and our overall experience there if you want to check it out on our channel and thank you so much for watching.